Hi, I'm Jared. Hi, I'm Mark. And we're from the Broken Seal. Today we're going to be playing Bantam West, where people in in a alternate Wild West trying to make our make our name for ourselves or something get, like that. Get some notoriety. Yeah, uh, some it's real fun. It's yeah. a, there's a lot of different things you can do to win. Uh, it's not just one clear objective. And with no further ado, thank you all for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Check down below right for ways that you can support us on Patreon or YouTube memberships. And take it away, guys. Sorry. <laughs> take it away. <laughs> Recently, you've fallen on hard times. But what's new? Thankfully, the local saloon, Miss B's Haven, has reopened uh, after some renovations. From what you've heard, the legendary saloon is in absolute... Wow, this is a, a font. <laughs> is an absolute staple of Gallo Springs. It is loud, warm, welcoming, and full of interesting and peculiar individuals. Some of those individuals have a lot to bring to the table, and I'm sure you can win them over if you have enough to offer them. Just be careful, because once you become a leader of men and women, you must deal with their issues and risk losing them to a rival posse or even death. Death, I don't know why it's in like <laughs> Tread carefully now and lead from the heart. You are now a leader operating in the shadows of this small community a shadow governor so that's what the setting is called which is like the standard, shadow governor yeah the standard setting is shadow governor so odds and evens to figure out who goes first let's do it all right i'll call it this time okay we'll go with even one two three so five you get to get to add if Hell you want yeah. to go first i assume you do um you can go first oh you piece of shit yeah <laughs> do we draw those left and right now yes okay. so i I don't remember it in the book, but I'm just I feel like it's better if we do like two. Two and pick one? Yeah. Okay. And we have to do all of these to win. Yes. Or we have to get ten? Uh all of those five and then all of these five. Okay. So here's the other. Two of those. One of these two. Alright. Whoa. <clears throat> and at the top they have like a little like each one has a word. So, like, mine is Wise Collector. <laughs> I can go with Insane or Sly. <laughs> I think you should be an Insane Prospector or some shit. I can do an Insane Vagabond. I like that. Fuck it. Let's do it. I like that for you. Fucking Agent in Chaos again. These are the ones you're not picking? Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, uh, mm. Mark, Mark and I were talking before the recording. Um, this game is massive. Yeah. There's too much to have on the screen. So as your your loyal servant, I'm gonna keep all my stuff over here so you all can see it. Mark gets the you know the benefit. I'm gonna keep it off camera yeah. so I can cheat. So that he can actually like play yeah. without having to be like, wait, what's this thing? Yeah. <laughs> wait, where's that thing that I just put? Um You know what's crazy? I can't, oh here it is. I was like, I don't know where my player card is. Oh fuck. My um the card catalog, that's what I was thinking of. Alright, anyway, so I'm gonna be first. So as Jericho Jones, I'm starting off in the trading post. And I'm I'm the marshal around these parts for, for right now. Jones. All right, so as we know, we need money. Yup. And uh, right now, wood. So ironically enough, wood is the the high okay. commodity. So for a while, it will be a logging simulator. Yep. <laughs> Uh, if you don't know what that is, go look at our uh, game, <laughs> game night video to do this. So I'm going to go, right? Because I don't see many little ones. Oh, there's some over there. Yeah. So how do you get to that? So, okay, so you have to go here right. to get to that. I so I would go, I'm going to spend one grit to go one, two, three, and then four. Okay, I'll spend another grit. To go one, two. I'll spend one more grit to do some logging. So, just these two. I got one, so I get one wood. You get two, right? Because it's three? It's four. Oh, wait, I'm looking at the wrong thing. You're right. So, yeah, uh, since logging over here requires a three or higher, each of these counts as separate uh, attempts to log. And if I get three or higher on both of them, I get two. Let's go over here into my inventory. And it doesn't look like there's any weather events over here, so I'm okay to stay outside. 
So I'll log again. That's two more. And that is my turn. Okay. Yeah. Um, okay, I'm starting at the... Park clearly is trying to get to a hidden station. Acre. Then I'm going to do one grit for one... Where does it go? Yep. Two, three. I'm going to do another one to get over here. Then I'm going to go log in. Where do I start? One, two, three. I'm going to put back two wood because I, I, for some reason I thought my speed was four. Okay. So I would have had to use an extra grit to move. So I get one wood. Mm -hmm. your, your resources are over there. Oh, shit. Nice. I was like, I'm going to make it easier for everybody. Resources on both sides. And then I'll do it again. Uh, I'm going to get two. Do me a favor, say something here, Mike. Some, some, some. Am I fucked up? Yep. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Good old Jared. I'm pretty sure what we said in the beginning was fine. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, works. we're back. Mark's playing Mika Man Killer. He started off at the station, skedaddled over to where I am. Skedaddled a dude, and then I um, did two login runs. Got okay. Three woods. All right. So then that is the end of the first day. Yep. Um, following our night phase, fire spread. We have no fire. There is no weather. Unless I'm blind and didn't see it. Um, where would it be? It'd be on the bottom. So like okay. frostbite, yeah, I don't see downpour. It looks like these two don't have any weather because they're like nice places or something. Who knows? Um, we don't have any earnings or cabins. We do our night action, so if any of these trigger, you can... I'm sleeping in the same uh, acre as an enemy NPC. I'm not an NPC. You're right. Fool. <laughs> uh, and then sleep. If we So we reset all of our grit and any exhausted items. If we had something that restored, that's when we would do it. But since you and I are both just an open, nothing yeah. happens. Then we advance the calendar. Oh, can you put out six of those? I forgot about that. The purple ones are legendary, too. So that's like, they're special. Damn. This is a, looks like a modern day pistol. This one? Both this of them. Too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so then the cool thing, now that we're at the restock part, Put six on top of those. Oh, shit. But you can only take the top one. Right. Okay. Um, what is an entry tool? Does it have an icon next to it? Just kidding. That was on the other card, so I guess it doesn't matter. Okay. Uh, fire starter would just be... Anything that has the fire, the fire symbol. fire symbol? Yeah. Okay. So, like, for instance, I need to take a hidden path, which means <clears> that <throat> I need the key. Okay. Um, your fire starting shit is just anything over there. Okay. Or if you were that other woman who can start fires. Oh, you could make your own? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So, I'm first player. And now we're in August. Because for some reason, I don't know what comes after July. I'm going to spend one grit. Do some logging. All right, I got two. Then I'm going to spend three wood to build a cabin. Get Mark off my land. You son of a bitch. Put out my, my nice little cabin card. It may not be on screen, but you know. This one will be. So if I build a second one, it won't be on screen. And... That's two grit. Um, it was two grit? Well, one grit to log, one grit to build oh, a cabin. Oh, okay. Yeah, because I only had two. Um, one, two. Maybe I can fuck off back. No, no I'll log again. Well, that's just one. And I will log one more time. Because I forgot that I can just sleep in my cabin. Wow. Well, no. that's karma for you. So then, free action, skedaddle into here. Okay. And then I sleep. Your turn. 
I'm gonna try to burn down your cabin. Oh, you know what? Hold on one second. I didn't realize that this doesn't cost an action or a grit, rather. The For what? my cabin perk. Once during the day phase, I can use I can sell two resources. Oh, gotcha. You can I can trade two resources for, for one, one resource. resource. Yeah. So I'm going to trade these two for a pelt, which means I probably didn't win that uh <laughs> that game night video. Oh, because you were doing it, you were selling it for money. Because that's what Coulter's let him do. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure he said, "Oh, we can do that." And I was like, "Oh, cool! I didn't realize it, but now I realize it." Yeah. So. Gotcha. Coulter would have won probably. I'm going to um, keep the victory. I'm not going to burn down your cabin. Okay, cool. I do get a check mark, though, because I use the cabin perk. Nice. You're not going to burn down my cabin? No. Good. Do you even have a fire starter? Do I need one? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, the... Okay. Use an item. I'm going to go one, two, three. You could have gone logging over there. If logging is what you're in. Yeah. Um, How do I get to this one? That is the north. And that pops out here. Mm -hmm. Three, one, two, three. And you're going to get frostbite in there too. If you don't have a camp, Mark's gonna go fight. Fuck. Which I guess thematically does make sense. Like you have to prepare to go into the cold. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna do another one. One, two, three. Those aren't even kind of connected, Mark. Are they not? <laughs> My bad. One, two, three. There we go. <laughs> Which I guess technically the worst, just the way you did it. Yeah. Whereas it would have been like that. <laughs> Actually, no. Where were you here? Or yeah. Here? I was there. Here? So then, yeah, one. Okay, one. And then that would connect it here. And then three. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, I did it right. You did it right. You, you just moved them diagonally. And that's what confused me. <laughs> one, two. You're going to go fight that Puma? If I go here, I'll get shot, right? Yes. Unless you beat him. Which you don't have a gun in this one, so you don't have any ranged weapons. Let's start an ambush. And I'll do another one. One, two. But then... You had more movement. But, I mean, I want to stay on here. No, I mean... Because this was three, right? Yeah. So one, two, would have gotten you somewhere else for a three. Oh, here? Yeah. Okay. And then you have one saying. more grit. That's why I was saying you could fight the Puma, because then you could end up on that for three and then fight it. Yeah, if that's what you're in. He's fuck me up, though. Right? He is. Well, no, that mean He's got what, two health? Yeah, he just got two health. I'm over here talking like I know what right? I'm Yeah, like, Puma's not shit. Right, yeah, Mark. you can take the Puma. Yeah, Fuck you, it. your character has an axe. <laughs> um, God damn it, Jerry. Right, fuck it. I'm going to go over here. Okay. And then I'm going to end. All right. Ending the night phase. Or ending the day phase. Fire spread. Weather. You take one damage because you are I do. in the wilds. And I get a check mark. Oh, for what? Experiencing weather? Uh, yep, experience weather. Yeah, I don't have that. I mean, I, I have that. I haven't done it. I assume since there was no weather over there. Um, earnings. If you had a banknote or, like me, something in your cabin. Uh, sleeping. Reset all your grit. Heal up if you're in a spot to let you heal. I don't heal here, right? No. Okay. And restoring advanced calendar. Now we're in September. And it is my turn. Oh, my turn. What you doing on your turn? I don't know. I kind of wanted. It's just wood over here, huh? Yeah. 
Fight that puma. That's an alligator. Fight that alligator. Or crocodile, whatever they're supposed to be. You know, go fight that that guy. No, bandits are hard. I remember you fought them. Yeah, I got my ass kicked <laughs> yeah. the first time. I learned my lesson watching you get yep. shit carried. I'm going to move for one. Oh, you know what? We did not draw any events. Oh, shit. We should have drawn three. I moved. And then I so moved. I moved. So I would have drawn one. You would have drawn one. And then I would have drawn the second would, one. Yeah. So let's, I'll do my first one okay. from the before. Skeletons map. Number 39. During, all, uh, during your travels, you see the sunlight glinting off something in the distance. Upon investigation, you find the glint is from a rusted revolver resting in the clutches of a skeleton. Not far away is another skeleton clutching a tattered map. Looks like the two had shot each other and just outside the reach of Tau. I don't know what that was. Keep this card and choose. Take it to Rita's and sell it. Follow the map and find a chest. Or dig them a grave and bury the dead. Hmm. Alright, can you draw yours? What does it say? Read this when the locality occurs. So read everything on the top first. And then what's the date of the locality? Oh, you know what? Yeah, re what's the date? So June. So we put a thing on June? Yes. Okay. There it is. So in June, we so don't basically you yet. don't, yeah, you don't yeah. read anything until okay. June pops up. So that you keep that. Cool. And then this then would have been your third. I'll read this when the locality pops up. Well, uh, September. Actually, I don't know if we can have more than one. Because technically there's only supposed to be three markers. So let's see. Localities. Oh, does does the thing match your, um, does the icon on the top left match there, because that's where you're traveling to. Uh, it it's town. I mean, it's the town symbol. Right. So since you were going away from the town, it doesn't. It doesn't. Pop off. So you put it on the bottom here. So then this one wouldn't pop off either, because that's right. a town symbol too. Mm -hmm. So then, do we pull events when we're moving from here to town? Then whenever too? we're yeah. So oh. whenever you change tiles for the first time. Got it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So like for me, even still, so those are on the bottom. So I this one would still pop off because I moved on that turn. I moved from town or from oh, yeah, yeah, right. to town. Yeah. So this one would stay. So this one is the September one. Okay. And this just. Oh, so here's a cool thing to know as well. Since that one is September and we're currently in September, it doesn't pop off. So it so, waits until. Oh, no, it gotcha. just doesn't happen. Jared's cheating again. Hot look, you got the books. Yeah. Cool. And then now that I'm traveling. So I pop out over here, sped one grit. I go one, two, where am I at? three, and then I get an event. I specifically put them there because I was like, that way it's in between and yeah. we always have to move over and we'll see it. I forgot nope. that. Your thirst draws you to the sound of a nearby babbling brook. As the brook comes into view, so does a young woman dressed in striped jumpsuit. Damn, she looked. I'll show you after. She hasn't noticed you yet. So you quickly hide behind a tree and continue to observe. Upon further inspection, you notice a sea grave asylum patch on her shoulder and broken shackles around her ankles. As she washes her face in the river, she uh, exudes an eerily composed disposition. What will you do? So look at her. She's a siren. Don't. It looks cool. She's all badass Damn. and shit. She gonna fuck you up. Probably. It is your thing match? The first one you drew? Yeah, so this one has all. Oh, okay. Yeah. If they're all, then yeah, no matter where all, you're going. Yeah. Uh, approach her and introduce yourself. She looks like she's in need of a friend. Wave at her from a distance. Leave a change of clothes on the ground and be on your way. Or say, stop right there, criminal, but I have to have a gun. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to approach her and introduce myself. Looks like she needs a friend. I'm trying to be a shadow governor. So I need a seven or higher on my uh, persuasion. I have a base of a four. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, also, when I, I forgot when I slept, I got one willpower, which I am now going to spend to reroll that. Nice. So I get it. Um, since you have the, the green book, at the back of it, there's an events list. You can find number 17. Uh, gain one writer or keep this card face up. Earn one notoriety point, I think. Oh, cool. And see bonus. Two... Keep this card and see bonus three, earn one, take three, and keep this card face down. Okay, so, so I would do one, two, three. Yeah, I do the one, the first one. That's what I I rolled for the, okay. the good friend. So I Game get one, one notoriety. 
Uh, is it's that star one? Is that notoriety? Right. Um. Got a little star symbol. Yes. Okay. So I get one notoriety, and I get one rider. Get one rider. Oh, cool. And it says NC bonus. The bonus is if you keep this card during a fight, discard this card immediately after a successful attack to do one extra damage. Damn. I'm gonna get this, which okay. also when I get gives me one resource. Or uh, notoriety. I don't want that resource. And I'll keep it, so I'll put that over here. Um, now with the rest of my turn, I'm gonna spend one. Which one's Rita? Over here. One, two, three. Pop in to see Rita. I'm gonna sell her this. Oh, it costs a grit to spend. Where is that? And then I need you to read number thirty-nine, number one as well. Number one. Yeah. I like uh, the way of not reading to see what they are, like what the outcome is, because yeah. I have them. I can read them for years too. Uh, take three gold. Oh shit! Yeah, you're the or banker. I guess three monies. One, two. I'll take three gold coins. Three. <laughs> All right, so I have three money. Money, 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 money. Uh, bonus. Well, it didn't say it didn't say keep the card, right? No. Okay. It just so take then, three. Yeah. yeah. While in Rita's, I'm gonna sell. And since Does someone that is a cost anything a selling, gray? or no, no, okay, because it's gray. So if if they're like that, then it's no action. That's why I remembered this one. If it's white, like there, then it and is then an it's action. A grit. Okay. Yeah, grit. Yeah, I'm gonna sell my pelt, which normally sells for two, right? Pelt sell for one. Okay, well then it sells for two because it's it's in season. Okay. So if I could have two more, or actually, yeah, give me two more. Thank you. And with my last action, I'm going to I'm going to spend one grit and move one, two, three, and then I'm going to buy from him. I'll get a torch. Torch. How much does it cost? Three. Okay. There you go, sir. Thank you. You can put that in the okay. link for me. And that's the turn. All right. I'm going to go. I'm going to first build a cabin. Um, I'll put out your... Mining is five. Damn. What's a five? Uh, mining to get oh, yeah. resources. But they also have the highest sell rate. Probably need some money first. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to mine. You can use willpower. I don't have any. I'm neutral. Oh, I guess I yeah. can, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'll use, and I just choose one to reroll? Yes. Nope. Nope. Okay. Well, that was shitty. Uh, was building shitty. a cabin, was that a... One grit. One grit? Okay. Yeah. Did you know I was just keep mining? Yeah. I like that now that I know that like each round is a is a month, it makes more sense where it's like, I'm out here it's all like month. It's like doing a yeah. yeah. Okay. Thematically, okay. even though, you know, obviously. What do I want to do, Jared? Lose. I gotta remember these things. Oh, I passed the persuasion check when I talked to her. Are oh, you fucker? I was like, I feel like I was supposed to do that. Yeah, so there's three years in this calendar, and people are like, I thought it was really cool that you have to use the birth year. Damn, you screwed up. Fuck. <laughs> I find it's really cool that I have to use the birth year, but at the same time, like, if my birthday is like February, then it means one month or the next day we're over to the new year. And they're like, you don't need to worry. Like most of our games were like eight months long. Like you don't need to, yeah. you're not going to have a whole year and shit. Um, when I go down here, do I lose one vigor? Yes. Right away? Yeah. Okay. I'll do it. 
I like to think you get like a bloody nose. So yeah, nice. there you go. Okay. There's one vigor. And one. And I get silver bar. I guess it goes on. Oh, yeah, you can put it in your cabin because you're on the cabin space. I guess that's like a free action rate to yep. do. To swap them back and forth. Okay. Um. And then what does the weather event do? I just lose one? Yeah, frostbite would move one. But you, you can also just go in your cabin. Yeah. Unless you're moving away from it. And you didn't leave, so you don't get an event. Because you've been there the whole time. Yep. Yeah. I've been here the whole time. We'll see. This is tough, Jared. You wanna... How much is that thing going to fuck me up? I mean, you got one health. Well, technically two. And a nice warm cabin. So how am I going to... This is a good question. Uh, sleep in the same acre as an enemy NPC. But if I go in an acre, or an acre with an NPC, they're going to attack me. They attack you in the night phase, though. Oh, so like I would get that, and then I would get attacked. Right. Okay. Which, it, I don't. it's not an ambush, I don't think. It's in the green book for for clarification on it, but because it depends on what their symbol color is. So like that one there is yeah. zero to one and it's white. And I think white means that they attack you at night. Let me see. Fighting. I've always thought it's real weird that like, even if you download a PDF, it still like has to load in the pages. Yeah. Like why? Okay, so that one means it will attack you if you end your turn within range of listed while in line of sight. So that would be a nighttime action. Okay. And then when does this pop off? When does the... Also at night. So I'm trying to figure out like what the stack looks like. Cause I, it, well, so here's is, the like, thing. End, end your turn with one vigor. So when I end my turn with two vigor then that wouldn't really do anything but then once the once the weather pops off and then takes one vigor away from him at one vigor so at I that think point it's, do I, I do think it with the night thing it's during the night phase if that happens okay i can double check though that that one would be in the red book the to-do list refer to your tasks your character and their organization they create are trying to complete so yeah i'm going to say since the right phase is nighttime stuff, if at any point during the night phase it happens, then you would then it, it pops would off. Pop okay. Off. So like, and then since they have an order, fire spreads, then weather. But if you're where the the bandit is, you're in a campsite, so you don't take damage. No, I was gonna go here. Oh, okay, because that that's technically an enemy NPC, right? Yes. Okay. So like, if I pop off here, because that's my last grit, mm -hmm. then fire will spread. No fire. Weather, weather hits, you take I one. go down one, I mm -hmm. get one, mm -hmm. and then I'm ending my turn here. Which means that they would attack you. But then I get another one. Right. Okay. Yeah. But then like I might If die. that's what you're going to, if that's what you want to yeah, do, yeah, then I yes. that's what I'm going to do. Okay. Yep. So Mark ends his turn there. Because I'm an insane vagabond. So. A, yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm playing to sense. my character. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So uh, fire spread, there are none. Yep. Weather, Mark takes one damage. I take one and damage. Check mark. I get a check mark. A check mark. Uh, earnings Mark gets a check mark. So your cabin generates one. Yes, it does. My wood, my cabin generates one wood. Um, night actions. So and this then, would be when they would attack you. Okay, and then I get. Oh, because you slept in the same yep. acres NPC. Oh, you know what? Here's the crazy thing. Night actions come after sleep, or yeah. before sleep. So it goes night actions and then sleep. So in theory. As long as you don't leave that square uh, acre, you're fine okay. after the combat. So right now you don't have the sleep thing. Okay. Because that's after this part. But so but now if we're going to die. Do yeah. If you die, I'll then you fuck. don't get to sleep with it. Okay. You don't get to sleep with the Puma. <laughs> I guess I'm already here. So fuck okay. it. Okay. Um, so vagabond. shuffle your, your, your combat deck. And then you get the top four. This one is just going to do the top card. Uh, it is the attacker though. So it's going to go first. Okay. So. Oh, they don't have the. Oh, all, uh, there we go. Attackers' cards execute first. And then remember, there's those cancellation things. 
Hmm? Like the cancellation oh, icon yeah. on the top yeah, left? Yeah. yeah. All right. And bam. So this one is going to charge you. Oh, mine's a block. So you cancel my block. Yes. So your block is canceled and it does one damage block. to you. So he did, or she did. <laughs> Fuck. So <laughs> the I insane that, vagabond. I wouldn't, I wouldn't have I mean, done we can, that. We can, we can, we no, can reverse it's it. All, it's all good. Okay. I mean, I feel like it plays into my insane, the insane vagabond, vagabond character. So the insane so. vagabond tries to take out a, a puma. Yep. With, with one their health. bare hands, with one hand. <laughs> so you get popped over to dock. Yep. Jail, right? Or no, dock, yeah. yeah. It's not illegal to sleep with a puma. Well. Well. <laughs> and I'm also going to say, since you're teleporting by means of whatever magic gets you back to the doctor you don't get an event yep because you're not actually sense. doing it. um all right so then you you lost the fight now we would go to the restore action so you do get to restore all of your shit because that's what the doctor lets you do okay just my vigor right not well your my... grit your grit comes back anyway that's the standard yeah but not my uh, willpower no okay Um, you also need to pay to get out, which means you're gonna have to. Hold on, losing hmm. PvE. If you faint, or you lose PvE, faint. you must immediately drop all resources and head. Also known as loss. Which one are you looking at? So it says Doc Barber allows you to spend one gold to kill Max Vigor and release. Yes. So I don't necessarily have to. No, so you, you you that's what that means here is that it's required to get out. Oh, I'm trying have, to figure out how to I don't have yeah. gold though. Because I think you might have to use your your um resources. Because you do have your stuff on the cabin. So yeah, it's for jail it says you have to pay three dollar bail to release. Any form of payment is accepted, resources common weapons heads and the jail does not give you change if you pay with something more valuable than three in advanced game mode you may pull from the cash on your bank note as well if you cannot pay through dollar bill you must lose one notoriety doc barber allows you to spend one gold to heal. oh so that's how you get it if you spend one gold you heal okay so if i trigger. just wait here overnight i still yeah get a vigor and i don't have to pay any gold right because isn't that part of the night action? it does say end day here Oh, no, upon release. So, yeah, you don't get the vigor until you pay one gold. Okay, but I can't pay one gold. You could use those resources. Is what I'm going to say. Although it definitely doesn't make sense. Like, it doesn't. Because there'd be no way that you could get out. So, I would say you would lose one notoriety if, in that case, then. I don't have any notoriety either. Because I'm a... You build a cabin. Vagabond. Oh, you're right. Okay. Yeah. So you would just pop down to zero. Okay. Yeah. Cool. You know, the main thing that notoriety is good for, I imagine there's probably events that have a reference on there too, but um, if you get to five and ten notoriety, you get to increase one skill. Okay. Yeah. Um, so anyway, we figured all that crap out. Um, when you get released, that's when you get your vigor, but we'll just say you have it now. You didn't increase your willpower because you were in jail. I mean, um, at the dock. And advance the calendar. Advance the calendar. And it's back to me. Um, that's grit. That symbol's grit. Yeah, Mark. So I have to... Yeah, release one grit. Give yourself back. <laughs> yeah. So it means that I can't do anything <laughs> this time, but next, my next turn, I have to use a grit. Good thing for you checking. Cool. Because I was like, cool, why cool. Why do they have a dollar yeah, sign? And then why sense. does the other one say one gold? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on, game. All right, so <laughs> we figured it out. Did yep. you give yourself back the one notoriety, though? I did, okay. and then I gained this. Right? Because end of night action? You, get you stored one there. And then one generated. Because then, when did you, you built that last turn, right? Yes. So did you store one on there? Because you should only have two. I didn't I do it. So I was here. Yeah. I used one. To build it. To build it. Oh, that's right. You, you, yeah. Yeah, and then so I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I think I'm I don't right. think I did mine, though. I don't think you, I don't know. Because I built mine before you. But you only have, oh, no, I did it. Because you have one, I have two. That, we're, okay. We're good. Okay. I figured it out. I mathed it. Um, the math is mathing. Uh, all right. So, my turn. Now that we figured out Mark's long answer. Yep. <laughs> Spend one grit to go one, two. 
What leads into the bank? Oh, just, okay, so three. So I'm going to go into the bank. Wait, so, sorry, going back to my long-ass turn. Yeah. It doesn't really make sense doing it the way we did it and me not getting this because there's no way for me to end to sleep in the same thing as an enemy because, like, in combat, I'd even have to kill the enemy or they would kill me. Oh, yeah, you're right. So, so yeah. I think I would just get that, right? We'll and like everything else would be fine. Your logic is there. That. Yeah. Because if we did it in this urn, in this order and you beat the then enemy, I still there's nothing there. be sleeping yeah. in the same as an NPC. Okay, yeah. I like it. That boom was hungry, or fed. Yep. <laughs> and took Got a, a chunk of my ass. ass. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to open a banknote for no grit. So I'm going to spend one. Okay. Which goes here into my... That's not, that's not going to be on screen. I'll, you know what? I'm going to do one full rotation on here so y'all can see it. So it goes here. And then each night it increases in two. Okay. Um, so that was one action. And my second grit. I'm going to go one, two, three. Next action. One, two. Last action. Let's get some locks. All right, two lock. Which I am going to trade in three of. I'm pretty sure that didn't cost a grit. Level endeavors, no grit, yeah. So I spend three from my cabin to level up my logging. And now I'm a journeyman. And I can have up to two cabins at a time. Oh, and leveling an endeavor... I think it's only when you master it you get notoriety. Notoriety, yeah. I think so. Okay. Yeah, that's my uh well, end of my turn, I'm gonna pop into the cap. Because why not? That's my turn. Okay. So one grit is to get out of docks. Mm hmm Um then I'm gonna do That does suck though, you have to spend a whole grit just to yep. get out. Oh, oh, before you do anything, the oh, event. Yeah. That I clearly passed over. Painted skies. The sun is about to set, and your surroundings seem to emit a pinkish hue. You let out a sigh and feel an almost overwhelming sense of relief as the day comes to an end. You're about to call it a day and enjoy the gorgeous sunset when you spot one more resource that is easily within reach. Cancels all previous weather effects. Immediately, all players outside of town receive one resource matching their current location. Cool. I get one wood. Oh, it's a weather. Okay, you your turn. Okay. I think it might stay out, but that's why I want to. So you when they get out, and then I'll do another two. How do I get to this one again? Where is north? It? North. Okay. Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Another one, two. And I'll go in my cabin for free. For free. Then I'll sell two of these at market price what's the market price oh. for two for the silver uh, yeah two yeah, so two. Uh, four mm -hmm. I get four gold it doesn't say it but since it says it cancels all previous weather effects on here I'm just going to assume that the weather stays out until another weather effect yeah comes. that makes sense because why else have a weather effect Either that or it cancels these weather effects, which also doesn't make sense because I didn't do that at the end of my turn. Yeah. So, anyway. so you, is that all your, you have one more grit? I have one more grit. You want to go fight that Puma? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I got what I got from it. Actually, you can mine and then pop back in. Getting a head, is that from an animal or a, an yes. NPC or, or animal or a... Bandit? I'm going to say yes because there is no thing on here that says defeat or like get a bounty. Okay. So okay. I'd say it counts. What, are you gonna fight the guy instead? While I'm naked? Yeah. That cougar ate all your clothes, right? <laughs> okay, yeah, I'll pop out and then I'll mine. Okay. Just like I knew he would. Nope. Then I'll pop back in. You don't want to use a vigor? I don't have any. I'm already at I the. Know. Or willpower? <laughs> I'm already at the end end. I didn't increase my willpower. I don't know. I'll penalize myself. I don't remember if I... I don't think I did, but I'm not going to do it now. Oh, I have one more... Uh, willpower? Thing. Your willpower is already at neutral. 
No, it goes up though. For the for the cabin, you just increase it by one. Oh no, up no, to neutral. Yours is neutral. Damn, mine sucks. Don't be cheating. I'm trying to. <laughs> I'm trying to. <laughs> um, oh, you popped across, so you get an event. Oh, you're right. See, we're getting there. Um, nope. It's a town okay. again. Why are all mine? All of mine Fuck. are alls, and yours are just you know only town. I doesn't get to see the cool bitch. stuff. I don't. All right, so we 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 go memes. Um, fire spread, weather. No one's outside though. Earnings. Get one of your things in your cabin. Oh, and and my banknote increases, and I need two gold to add to it, sir, or two money. Two monies. Money, please. Um, night actions. We have none. Sleep. Restore all your grit. And do whatever your cabin says. Uh, advanced calendar. Experience level. Ooh, I haven't made any progress on my next year. Okay. I'm still first player. Um, Alright, I'm going to pop out. I was like, where am I? I'm going to do some logging. Oh, I got a two. So that means I get two. And then I'm going to transfer one, two. And since this one gives me one extra, I'm just going to put it on him. Okay. Then that was one grit. Two grit. I'm going to go one, two, three. Event. Event. You're right. Pass right by it. Oh man, it's a it's a town event. <laughs> the surgeon's apprentice. You stop by docks on the way through town. As you walk in, the friendly bell on the door chimes, and you're greeted with a warm smile. Doc Barber approaches you, shakes your hand, and asks, "What can I do for you today?" I could ask him to heal all my wounds, spend the den oh, spend the day there as his apprentice, or smile back and take a lollipop. You just came here for the lollipop. I kind of want to become his apprentice, but also like I feel like you might rob me. So I'm <laughs> the insane vagabond. Why yeah. Would, why would he rob you? So for number forty-three, I'm just going to do number three. Number forty-three, you restore one vigor. Oh well. Okay. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> Thanks, Doc. I guess I'll catch you next time. <laughs> so then, with the rest of my shit, so that was one to log, one to move. Yep. Which got me one, two, three there specifically. So then one more. One, two, three. And then I'm going to sell some wood. One, two, three, four. To get four money, which I'm going to give you one. You can just give me five. Thank you. Yep. I'm rich and scared. So <laughs> And scared. Because Mark's going to start stealing. I know he is. I should go back to the bank, maybe. I'm going to buy a gun. <laughs> I'm gonna buy a gun. Oh fuck, I can't. I don't have any. Oh, you know what I'm gonna do? Spend one more to move. One, two. I'm gonna buy a horse. Look at the top. So when they're face How down, much are horses? Five. Okay. I could try and break them, but that would be another grit, and I don't yeah. have any. Um, when they're face down, you take the top two and then pick one. Put the other one on the bottom. Keep the one you pick. Okay. Can I go? Sure. Cool. Or do you have any else to do? No, I'm. I you was just did. picking a horse, but it's fine. So I'm gonna go with Rebel. Rebel has a mount skill. And also it has an unlootable cargo space, which I like. Um, I'm going to use my ability again. Do. One, two, three, oh, four. your cabin ability? Yep, my cabin ability. Um, and then I'm going to pop out. Oh, fucking stupid. Spend one grit to go one, two, <laughs> three. So I kept one of these in the little baggie so I would remember where it was. That was the one. The one that was there is the one that I um, kept in the baggie. Yeah. Nice. Um, and then I'm going to pop to... Pop, pop. Pop, pop. Pop another grit. Go here. To clarify, I'm not buying the saddle because that costs money. I was just You're seeing stealing what it was. the saddle. Uh, since this costs five. There you go. Um, and then I'm going to buy... For three, I'm going to buy this guy. Oh shit! You can only have one, one item. Item, huh? That's why oh. I realized I was gonna buy the gun, Fuck. and then I realized I would lose my torch. 
And then I'm going to do... What the fuck? Oh, is this... Is this a movement? Yeah. To get here? Okay. Just one. So I have to come out. One, two, three. And then I got to do another fucking grit to get there. If that's, we're going to the stable, yes. That's booty. <laughs> that's booty. Oh, damn it. I was gonna I was gonna say unless you have a horse that gives you more movement. Mine does not. It does not. <laughs> nice. Oh. What I do though get is his ability. Fuck. One, two, three. If malice check fails, Hunter receives seven wounds. Oh, this could go here. Okay. So then one, two, three. Okay. And then I'm going to buy a horse, too. Copycat. Three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Mine has, this one has a skill. It says Damascus Half Moon. What does that mean? Oh. It gets shuffled into your deck, and then if it comes up, you can use it. Oh, shit. Okay. That's why I got mine, because it had a skill. Also, because it had unlootable cargo. And what's the whistle? Whistle skill? What's the whistle skill? Do you have the deck? Oh. The whistle skill? I was like, the fuck are you talking about, Mark? <laughs> Thank you. Just saying shit. I was going to be like, damn, you can whistle for a horse? <laughs> this game rocks. Wow, that's kind of cool. I think I'll do this one. This one goes down. He just goes next to you. Somewhere. So you, you pick uh, who? I picked... Well, actually, um, to the camera real quick. Agamemnon. Oh, that's a cool ass name. So he has a skill... Uh, that is a whistle, and then he has plus one movement, and he has an item slot. Nice. I wish I had one. Uh, end of the day. Nope, I still got one more grit. Because that wasn't a grit to buy a horse, right? No. Um, but you could have broken the horse. You could have broken the horse. I should have <laughs> broken the horse. Can I have more than one horse? Probably not. Actually, it doesn't say you can, does it? Can I have more than one horse? I'm going to say for right now, you can't until I find proof otherwise. One, two. Also, I feel like in general, there's not enough in here about mounts. Um, I'm going to go to... Oh, I, fuck. I can't do that either. Shit. You can set up something for next time. Yeah. I would lose one. Fuck it. Yeah. You going to hobo it up again? Yep. One. One. Sorry, Jared. Two, <laughs> three. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm technically in the stables. All right. So then now we're at nighttime. Fire spread, weather, earnings. Chung chung. Uh, night actions, sleeping. So even though we're in town, so we don't gain anything other than our grit back and any unexhausted items come back. Okay. Um. So now that we're in December. Yep. Silver, which you should have held on to, because you plus one. Damn. <laughs> Sorry, I got a mine there. I'm still first player. Um, but now I have no money. One, two, three. Damn it. Oh, obtain a fire starter. Damn, that shit's real far away. Oh, okay, never mind. Here, so here's what I'm going to do. Spend one grit to go one, two, three. One more grit to cross up to here. Get an event. I didn't do an event when I went into town. That one was like an idiot. Okay, this one is... I think it's, it was a town. Read this when locality occurs. Oh, yeah, what's the date? Uh, it doesn't have one. 
When a locality is drawn, reference the number in the purple icon and place the calendar token from the supply that many months ahead of the current date with the pin side facing up. Okay. Okay. So two months from now? Uh, this one was a one. Okay. Yeah. If another uh, this is good to know. If another locality is drawn while one is already on the table, put the one on the bottom. Sweep the card to the bottom of the event deck and do not draw another event for the rest of that turn. So I'm guessing you don't replace the one that's already out. Okay. Occasionally, the pin will reference a specific month instead of a number. Only pin those events if they would occur later in the current year and at least one month away from the current date. Which is one month. Yeah, okay, so we're good. Right? Yeah. Because it wouldn't be on yeah. your current date. It'd be one month away. Yeah. Okay. So that was my movement, yep. which I needed. Now you need I needed that. that. Yeah. Flash Floods. Not here, though. Nice. Because okay. that's purple. Yeah, that's digital. The wetlands. Is it one, two, three, two grit? It goes one, two. Uh -oh. You going right here? Is. Yeah, where that guy is. And then with my second or third grit, I'm going to jump across because I have a torch. Okay. So I'm going to go to the cave. Um, And because I took a hidden path, I get a little check mark. Nice. And then I guess let's try and fight this Puma. Why not? You know? So. I hope he fucks you up. Here you go. You shuffle that up. <laughs> Please, I'm not you, Mark. I have a horse. Does the horse give you combat stuff? No. Okay. Not at all. You're just saying you have one? I do have one. All right. Uh... Okay, I'm going to go with that. So I'm going to do a blitz. Mine is a, a, a dancing dude. He's going like that. Okay. This one does not block it. <laughs> and mine blocks guns. Okay. So I'm the attacker, so that means I go first. Yep. I'm going to do... So you have to roll a uh, strength. Roll strength. Oh yeah, yeah, strength. yeah, yeah. I was I was trying to figure out with my prim tooth in there. Um, so then I have a plus four. Damn, I did not make it. Nope. So what does he do? Uh, he bites you for one. For one. All right. Ow. Oh, I also get plus one to sneak. Oh, okay. I can use this ability at any point, but that needs malice, not have high malice. All right, next one. I draw one card. Right. Yeah. Um, I guess I will. I'm going to body slam. So it is a running and it blocks or it, uh, this, this blocks running. Blocks running. Yo. Is it the same kind of icon? Mm -hmm. I feel like they should have better icon. They definitely should. Okay. So yeah, so a mine gets blocked. Okay, another I'm the attack. Another one damage. Oh, fucking Puma. <laughs> My turn or uh, beginning. <laughs> I guess in that case it could. If it blocks it, do I still get to move? No. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I will. Wow, I'm gonna ta tackle him. So I have a, a, this one a running it. dude. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, my blocks. <laughs> Yours blocks. Yeah, it's, it's yeah, a, an attack. So another one damage to you. Okay. Yeah, it's not fucking easy, is it, Jared? It's fucking me up. <laughs> Where's my horse ability? <laughs> I, and I can move too, but I guess I don't really want to move. Yeah, it'd be either prime one or prime two. Primary yeah. one or primary two. Oh, okay, I'll do yeah. primary one. All right, and then I'm going to block. This one. This one blocks blocks. This one's block blocks. This is bullshit. Um, so he needs to uh, do a roll, and he needs to get a six. And his green, so it's a four? He has a plus four to it. Plus four? Okay. And he gets a one. Oh, That's a one. That's I'm cocked. counting it. No. That's cocked. <laughs> March cheating. Uh, Damn it. Six. So yeah. yeah. So I'm dead. Two damage. So I knock out. <sighs> yeah, it's not fucking easy, huh, Jerry? Pop me over here to dock, please. Uh, so you still have one grit, so you could pop out this turn. Isn't attacking one? Attacking is a grit. You yeah. know, I didn't even need to attack it. I never read about that. Yeah. I could have just left. Yeah. I'll, uh, I spent the grit, so I'm done. I'm done. Okay. Not going to take it back. Um, Okay. My turn. I'm, I'm going up. to... Oh, shit. I obtained a horse. Nice. I'm going to demand a drink from the saloon. You would. You... Oh, sorry. That's one. So five, six, seven, and you it's a seven. Drink. So what does that give me? 
one of those three at the top. Oh, one of these? Uh, no, the three what? drinks listed at the top. The fuck you talking about? Next to Miss B's Tavern, there's three drinks. Oh, okay. $2 max vigor. $2 max willpower. And $2 one. Uh, charisma. I just get to increase it by one? Until night. Until night? Okay, I'll do max willpower. Nice. And then... I get a drink more. I demanded a drink. Okay, so that was one grit to do that. Then... Go back there and fight that fucking thing. I'm gonna do... Um, so, one... Oh, all my resources dropped when two, I when I died, right? Three, and you want... Yeah, all of them that were on you. That one. There's um, a resources. And, and this pops off. Wild that. boar. You look down and see Does tracks... Does icon match? No, it doesn't. I can say, because I don't know if boars are in this. Why are you always taking shit away from me, Jared? Because I don't want you to read. You if I have to lose... You don't want me to have fun, Jared. No. Um, so it's one, two, three. One, two. And then I have this, so I'll also go over here. Three. So do I pick that up automatically? I'll is say that so. a grit? Yeah, because okay. it's on the acre. You're on it. Um... You want to fight that puma? Do I want to fight that puma? I think you should fight that puma. I don't think I want to fight that puma, Jared. Get that payback. puma's kind of scary. Also, you you fought a wolf over there. I did. Yeah. I was like, this one is actual. Oh, I see. Yeah. All right. Anyway, um, you got one okay. more. I mean, I got. I used a hidden path. Fucking Mark is gonna run away with this shit. Is there any secret areas? Is that the only secret area or hidden area? Hidden? Yeah. One here, one there, one up there. But nothing in here? No. Fucking of course. Yeah. Okay. I'll use my last grit to um, one, two, three, go in my cabin. Okay. Bloop. All right. Nighttime. Um, I could have stealth. I oh, I sure. Can I do my... Yeah, it's free action. Can I do that after I get... No, it has to be on my turn. On your turn, at any point, you can trade things back okay, forth. I but think... for your card, if it's in your cabin, that counts. Like if it says have three resources and you have oh, two I on see, your person and one on your cabin. That still counts. Yeah. Okay, then I'm gonna before my turn ends, I'm going to sell for market value. Okay. So that's three. Can you sell one or two? It says, yeah, sell two. Okay. Or ahead at market price. Okay. So, so three. Three for the silver. And then one for the wood? Yeah. Okay, so four. Damn. All of a sudden, the mark has money. I don't like it. And then nighttime action, right? Yes, nighttime. Fire spread, weather, which you don't have to worry cabin. about. Yep. Cabins get shit. Uh, I get... Well, I'll, I'll get it when I lo uh, leave. But um, you get whatever your cabin says for the restore, and then advance account. So, and then my said willpower to neutral. Does it pull me down to neutral if I'm above it? it says, oh, it says up, up to. to. I was up gonna to say neutral. Okay, yeah. cool. Um, then advance a calendar. It's January, which means your thing. You read your thing. Oh shit. Let's see. Um. The Midland Army's Red Dragoon occasionally pass through Gallo Springs and their rotation to the tumult, Terminus marsh Marshalling? Yeah. Marshalling <laughs> areas. It is traditional that the unit refills in Gallo Springs for one month before continuing their journey southward. The influx of cash and increased security has become like a holiday for locals. So, in the daytime, $1 discounts on everything in town, and players cannot fight each other, burn down, or breach each other's cabins. In town. In. Oh, no, because it says cabin, it, so that would be, yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, that's, so we can't fight each other at all. We can't fight each other at that's all. That's good to know. So, then that one goes over here, because it's a locality. So, for the rest of the, even though, so it's weird, this one has a number, but because it's a locality, you don't read the number. 
So it's like, why, why put a number on there? Wait, what, what do you mean? Don't read the number? Like, you know how, like for my event, oh, I was like, this is number 43. I see. But yeah. it's like marked out for some reason. Right. right. Maybe on a different game mode where there's like no localities, maybe. Yeah. Maybe that, maybe that's it. Um, okay. So then that's that, but this is the beginning of my day. I'm going to spend one grit to get out, which gives me full big, bigger. Vigor. All right. Now let me be smart about this shit. <laughs> One, two, three, four. All right, so I'm gonna go spend one grit. One, two, three, four. That's one grit. Event. Yep. Got all those. Um, doesn't match up. Oh, I have a plus one. Fuck. Yep. Forgot about that. I kept getting pissed that I didn't pick the one that had the plus one because I thought the skill would be better, even though it never popped off. Uh, I'll spend one more to go over here, which kind of sucks. And then one to log. It's log, log. Two. Nice. No, because it's a four or higher, I get four. Oh, shit. And then end of my day, I'm going to pop in. Okay. Uh, I am going to trade, though. You can do the... My cabin perk. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. You get a... a I can trade two for one. I'm going to trade these two for an herb. An herbaceous herb. Herbaceous Oh, no. Herb. Okay. And then that's my turn. He's coming out. One, two, three. Oh, you know what? Hmm. Remember we kept thinking that these things were like... Oh, but that's when you cross over. Right. And also, I think you can. I think you can. Too. Yeah. I think these connect to each other, but then the event word event means that you draw an event. That's what. So it's not about. every time that we go over. Anytime you, one. anytime you move between tiles. Oh, because this one yeah. says event. Mm -hmm. That one. Okay. Yeah. So, so we, do we want to play it? I am. I'm, I'm going to look it up while you're okay. going, but I'm, I'm 90% I'm, sure. I might, I might move across. As long as they have a connecting thing. Like this doesn't connect okay. because it's a mountain, but this does connect. Uh, but this connects here, but I guess this would need to connect with another one. Right. So like these match up okay. from what I'm, what I'm thinking from what I remember in the rules. Okay. But it's been a minute since I read the base rules. Okay. I'm going to, I'm going to fight this wolf. Ooh. Oh. Excellent. Let me know when you're ready. See if I get my ass kicked again. Hopefully. Hopefully not, Jared. No. Hopefully not. Here's moving. Okay. Okay. Bite. It cancels running. Okay. I got a punch. Well, you're lucky. Um. So we both do one damage to each other? Yep. Cool. Which means... What's his health? Two? He's at a two. Okay. okay. I'll just... I'll use this as its health. All right. Next one. Punch. Block. Fuck. It blocks punches and you take one damage. No. He gets one. Oh, it gets one. Yeah, so yeah. it blocked it, but then I think that's only for the round that it blocked it, though. I think so, too. Yeah. So, so if it was, like, more. Yeah. Okay. Charge. Blocks, Smoke blocks. Oh, this cool. one's not that. Okay. Uh, so then you're Try the attacker. One. I do one of damage to him. Which means it's knocked out. Before he could do one bit of damage to me, right? Yeah, because you're, you, as the attacker, your shit resolves first. Okay, cool. So, you get the head. Where does the head go? Head yep. limits three. Okay, so that was two. So, here it is. Regardless of how you arrange the tiles, all signpost icons connect to the signpost icon on the immediately adjacent edge of its neighboring tile. Okay, so this does connect to that then. Okay. Right? Because it, it says all regardless signposts of connect to the signpost icon on the immediately adjacent edge. Yeah, so that's immediately adjacent. So yeah. Okay. That's it. Okay, so that's good to know. You don't have to 
constantly come back into town. Yep. I'll put a little note in the beginning. I probably won't. So where is the hidden one view? Is there a hidden one view? Up there. Wait, the fuck up there? Okay, so if I go one... Okay, so I'm going to do another grit to do... So this goes no, one. There. Yeah. Nope. Did you... That's right, you started off there. Yeah. Okay. So that's one, two, three, four. Okay. Uh, you do have to roll to get in there, though. So, sneak. Yep. Four, eight. Cool. You made it. So you're in there. It sucks that I'm just wasting the thing, though. I mean, you could have no. done something else outside of it. No, because then I wouldn't have had enough to get to it. Ah. Yeah. But yeah, that's it. Okay. Then He's done. Is some pop off on there for you? Uh, yep. So at the end of the night, have one re or a resource, one money, and a head. All right. Then nighttime, fire spread. The weather, which I don't know why that one says ignore weather. That's what I see. I think these do. Like if they're a weather thing, I think they stay out. Okay. Because why else? Um, then earnings, so add one. Oh, I can't add anything to my cabin. That sucks. I'm not going to do it, but I could have just moved that over and then mm -hmm. up on the way. Um, and then I'm sleeping in a hidden acre, so I get another one. Ooh, Mark is two away. Uh, night actions, sleep. So I get all these back. I go up to neutral. Um, restore and advance calendar. Doop. So we are on February. This goes away. Okay, so we're no longer protected. No longer. And first player. Um, let's be smart here, guy. Let's be smart here, guy. Okay. Uh first I'm gonna use my ability to transfer two wood. Into one silver. Good call. Then one grit to go. One, two, three. You fighting? No, I'm going to reflect on what I've done by spending one grit, increasing my willpower by one, and reflecting in the same acre as an enemy NPC. Oh, fuck. I didn't even know that was a thing. For me, it is. Reflect? I mean, reflect. Yeah, that's a... Everyone has that one, okay. but yeah. Um. Then I will... End your turn there, right? Oh, 100%. Yeah. Use one more grit. Okay. I'm going to go one, two... Where's my that? Three? Yeah. Right. Yeah. In an event. Uh, God damn it. <laughs> well, it's a later on event, so it'll happen in March. Um. So that was three. Because one. That was four. One to move there. One, two. One to reflect. Oh, you're right. One to move. Three. Okay. And then one to. So you you tell me about this one. For the vault here, it says there's no entry from the bank. And that you need a key or a, what you call it, a key or a, a, a break thing to loot the chest. But can I just go in there? Because my thing tells me to uh, sleep in the bank wall. I mean, you have a key thing. No. You do. Oh, I do. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, yeah I'm going to, with my last grit, pop in there, move, and then. You just, like, won't loot it, but, like, you're in it. I mean. Right? Because it says to loot, you need a, a yeah. break thing. I got a, like, I got a lot there, of rolls. Yeah. Oh, I can't break it. I don't have the break icon. Yeah. But to get in there, I'm in there. Yep, you're in End there. my turn. And I get not only sleeping in the bank vault, ending my turn with three different resources. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, got to find where my other things went. Um, oh, 
I did do this, sleep in a cabin with all resource slot filled. Because when I was here, remember I was saying I couldn't transfer mm. shit out. Damn. Yeah, but that's my turn. Okay. I'm going to move. Also, these are night things, so let me not do that. In theory, you could knock me out. That's true. That's true. Yeah. So I'm going to put them like to the side of it. Okay. <laughs> but you still got those other ones, though. Oh, yeah, this one I did get. Is that one you got last night? And end my turn. This one doesn't say to sleep. Huh? It just says end your turn. Yeah, this one right? says end my turn. The sleep yeah. one I'm going to keep off because okay. that one is a is a maybe. So one, two, three, oh. four. I was using it to track health. <laughs> You get in my cabin? I'm going to try to burn him down. Burn it. Yes, sir. So you're going to need a malice of six with yep. a, a, a torch. So that one gets, a torch. It gets turned to the side. And I might go to jail. And you also might burn yourself. Because yeah. you don't have a ranged torch. So when you light the fire, everything in the acre takes damage. Okay. Four plus six. So you hit. Yup. So one fire is added. And, and the fire spreads at night, right? Yes. Okay. But I think, let's look up the arson shit because we definitely didn't do it last time. No. Um, arson. To start a fire, you must have a weapon and an item to displays the start, uh, fire starting icon, aka a fire starter. You may spend no grit to exhaust that card to place one fire token anywhere within range listed on the card and within line of sight. The person who started the fire is now referred to as the fire raiser. And is responsible for that particular fire. The fire raiser loses all vigor when they have one or more active fires. The fires remain, but they are sent to jail. Uh, if any players or NPCs are actively in the cabin, in an acre or cabin where a fire token is placed, they immediately suffer one wound. Okay. Only during your turn may you interact with the fire when it's initially lit, and have a chance to avoid taking the initial wound. Okay, that's my so, turn. So yeah, it says look for interacting with fires. Here it is. When you enter an acre or start your turn in an acre containing a fire token, you must interact with the fire. If you choose not to interact, suffer one wound due to smoke inhalation. Okay, so when you first start it, you get to choose one of these three things to do. Douse the fire, obviously would put it away. Navigate the fire. And befriending the fire. Oh, so I, it didn't take a grit for me to start it. Right. It's only taking me a grit to do these things. The things now? Yeah. I don't think so. Yeah. Oh yeah, fire interaction. No, yeah. fire interaction. Spend no spend no grit. To yeah, spend no grit. So I like I set the fire. But that also doesn't oh. require grit. Hmm? Starting the fire doesn't require grit either. Because this John said, um Yeah. You may spend no grit to exhaust that. And I didn't have to roll then. Because it says exhaust right. that and make anything. Although the only reason why I'm thinking it is because this says burn the cabin specifically. Oh, so like I could start a fire elsewhere. Right. But like if I'm starting to start a fire right. there. Because okay. like you're not starting fire to the acre, you're starting fire to the Okay, cabin. so I didn't spend a grid to start the fire. I just exhausted right. my shit. Mm -hmm. Okay, now interacting with the fire. After meeting, oh, here we go. After meeting or exceeding the malice check. Okay. Also, it's good to know because that's gray yeah. or it's transparent. So that means it doesn't require one. Okay. Um, after meeting or exceeding the malice check, the cabin is set a fire. While a cabin is on fire, all players may still interact with it, and all cabin door rules still apply. However, fires do cancel any restoration effects and endeavor opportunities. Okay. So. Okay. So then I try to interact with it to not take damage. To navigate it, right? Right. Fuck is my thing. So. Four, five, six, seven. Which means you beat it, because right now the check is a four. Okay. From that. So you navigate the fire and move your character from one side of the fire to the other or anywhere in between. You must meet or exceed an agility check even to the fire intensive. So. Okay. So I'll. So does it move me out? Yeah. Okay. So I'm out of square. Any any place you want. So since it was there, yeah. you go here, here, or there. I think I'm gonna go there. Okay. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna do. I'm gonna turn you into the jail. Um, one grit to move. Oh my god. One. What. All that shit was earning interest. Oh. Two, three, four. Another one to one, two, three. And you um, could you can just go because it splits. So you can just that would be two. Okay. Yeah. Um, and then I'm gonna buy 
when I buy, this just goes away? Uh, yeah, I'm going to assume so. Okay. I would imagine you don't like, have to stick with that the entire time there. I'm going to say for, for now, yeah. Okay. Or that you can just like choose to drop it or some shit. Oh, that means you don't use a skill. Like, um, our skills? Oh, it's without yeah. adding anything. Okay. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to do pay three to get pistol. Pay three to get a pistol. Okay. And this guy goes away somewhere. Yeah. Oh, and then that refills. Oh, Ooh, nice. And and your turn? I have one more grit. You could head out north. Head up north? Head out northward. Well, let me look up fire spreading now since that's going to happen. Okay, I'll do one, two, three, four, and then go into my cabin. Okay. And then before end of my turn, I'm going to sell these to get... Is it still uh, so three? It's three each. So okay, six. six. Damn. Three. Why don't you just get a five and a one? Six. Because I like having a lot of monies. You just like acting like you got money. Yup. All right. So uh, at night... Oh, so I'm going to give myself the other two from here. If you can yep. get me two. And I think that makes it a five. So actually, just give me a gold. And then... That resets to there. And I get one notoriety. Nice. Um, so fire spread. During the night uh, during the fire spread of the night phase, first all fires with no egg, uh, acres to which they can spread are considered burned out or burned down and removed. Then each of the fire raisers at the table with active fires choose only one of their fires, even if they have more than one, to spread by a single fire token. Each acre can only ever have one fire token on it, unless there is designated slots for fire tokens, i.e. cabin cards. Each individual fire can only exist in a single line of sight. Uh, wildfire cabin burned down. Here we go. Once all slots on the cabin card are filled. So I imagine you would just yeah. spread it to the cabin. Yep, I'm going to spread it so. to yours and burn it down. Do the, all those resources go away too? So you need to fill out all of them to burn it down. All four only two. Oh, fuck. Yeah. What? So once the fire spread there, then the wood goes away because oh, the fire okay. burned it down. Okay. Um... So it's not just a quick thing, which is cool because mine take four, your guys just take three. Yeah. Uh, so that's the end of the fire. Um. Then the weather, no one's outside, and weather shit. Earnings, so that's when that would have happened. Night actions, sleeping. I don't get anything special because I'm not anywhere cool. Uh, restore and advance the calendar. We are now in a new year. 277 AH. And our event goes off. Okay. Was this yours? Oh, this is mine. Ronum's Blessing. Uh, Struggler Ronum. The <laughs> Struggler Ronum, the catalyst of gunpowder and god of war. Without his blessings and guidance, the Death Helm frontier would not exist. From time to time, the townsfolk go before his statue in town and make offerings. While in Rotham Shrine, players may do... Only one of the following actions. Kneel and make an offering, spending one money or one resource. Steal an offering by using a six sneak with a chance of getting hurt. Or stand in defiance as worshippers gasp in disbelief and spend one grit or willpower. Okay. And it doesn't say that those require um, grit either. So yeah, One of them does, right? No. It's one of them is grit. willpower. Oh, okay. Yeah, one's willpower, one's money or resources, and one is a, a sneak. Okay. All right, so this did happen because I slept in the bank yep. vault. All right, so I'm going to spend one grit. One, two, three. And I'm going to sell... Yeah. So these sell for plus one, so that's two. And then two. So then four. Two, so four. I need four. I was like, what happened to all the money? Thank you, sir. Is that four? Yeah. Okay. I was like, I wasn't going to count it until you asked. 
then I got worried. Um, then I'm gonna spend another grit. One, two, three. And I'm gonna buy. I'll buy this, right? Because that's okay. three. Yeah. How do you get a writer again? Uh, going into the tavern okay. and it's spending five dollars or four pelts. Okay. Okay, I'll put it over here. Um, so, so that was grit. two grit. Third grit. One. Two. Oh, wait, no, I didn't do that. I was over here. Yep. One, two, three. Damn. And then fourth grit. I'm going to go. Wow, that's all over here. One. All right, fuck it. So here, one, two, three. And that'll be the end of my turn. Okay. Oh, I still have that pelt. I forgot. Where is it? Oh. Or that, oh, the head. The head, yeah. Okay, I'm going to do one grit to one. Oh, shit. Let me get this. You don't, I mean, because it would burn, right? Yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four. Oh, I forgot you had that horse. And then I'll do another grit to go here. And um, so you want to... I think I want to use one of these. All right. So you're going to stand in defiance. Yep. I'll read it for you. <laughs> That's number 35. Um, the crowd disperses. Discard, discard. Oh, fuck. <laughs> really? That's it? 35. The crowd disperses. Discard, discard. So you fuck. spent one. and What were the other ones? <laughs> uh, gain max vigor and willpower if you had knelt and make an offering. And gotten $3 or two resources if you stealed, stole. Stealed. Stealed. If I stealed. But that didn't take a grit, so it's just a two for the movement. I don't know what to do from here. You got two check marks to fill off. Yep. How do you. So I feel like you're probably trying to go and trying to stop the fire at your cabin. How do you stop the fire at a cabin? Uh, It would be a fire interaction to douse okay. it. Um. And also, I'm not going to try and do that. Oh, you're not. <laughs> but okay. douse the fire is a malice check. And remove all of that fire's tokens from the board, including all wildfire and cabin fire tokens if they are combined. You must meet or exceed the malice check equal to its fire intensity, which for the current fire here would be 4 plus 1. It wouldn't be 8 since there's... No, I, I also think it should have been 8, yeah. but also it'd be high number to get. But it's the original fire plus each... Subsequent is, one. Is a plus one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So from here, I'm going to do. I mean, fuck. You could like light more of the cabin on fire. If that's something you're trying to do. I don't have my fire starter anymore. Oh yeah. You could shoot the cabin, I guess. <laughs> Fucking shoot it. You also could have burnt down one of these abandoned cabins. I was thinking that. And I probably should have. Yeah. I just didn't. Because those are only three, and yours is four. Like yeah. a bitch. But you just wanted to be an ass. I did. Mm -hmm. I'm a I'm a insane vagabond. What do you What do you I'm expect saying. from me, Jared? <laughs> okay, one. Oh, fuck. What am I doing now? I have two things to do. Oh, how can I? How do I buy a saddle? Come here and spend three dollars. One, two. And then, what's your horse's name? Uh, my horse's name is Agamemnon. From the Bible. I don't know if that's true. I don't think that's true. I don't think it's true either. There you go. So you get those benefits on top of it. Damn. And this goes where? Uh, on the butt. Hmm? On the butt. 
on the butt. Mm -hmm. Okay. I think the artwork is supposed to match up. Like in theory, like if this oh, was my horse, it would match up. That's that's pretty dope. However, but you, then you won't would be forget. able to see it. Yeah. yeah. But is it just plus one speed? Plus one speed. So yeah, I just, is there all? Just yeah, plus one I think speed? they're all just plus one speed. I'm gonna forget though. Let's be honest. And okay. I definitely won't remind you. Yep. <laughs> they all are plus one speed, so I guess that is supposed to be the way they do it. So that was one action to get there. Yep. Or one grit to get there. So I have one more grit. Confirmed. Okay. Let's see if I can get a, an event going. Did I already draw an event? I should have drawn an event. No, you've been in town the whole time. Have right? I been in town the whole time? Because I because I burned last time, and then you came into and town. And then I came into yeah. town. Okay. So then I'll do. One, two, and then I'll go three. Which one? This one. Three. Now, if you don't attack him, he will attack you. Yeah. Well, I guess it's this event is first. And oh, yeah. Side. Which you would have went here, so to match the purple yeah. drawn. Nothing. Okay. And I only draw one event yeah. per rate. So, two. And remember, you can do an ambush by using your gun. Three. I, I have always imagined okay. that those would have to have an event on it. I'm going to go there. I'm thinking that it has to be, like, it ties into an event, um, into an actual event. Okay. Because... It'll I don't like, see it. Yeah. This place. And then. Because like maybe like one of the localities is like this takes you to this thing. Okay. And the locality is it. But otherwise I don't see anything okay. that links I'm gonna to stop it. stop there then. Okay. Then that's the end of your night. Um, night fire or night fire spread. Yep. Burns up one of my woods. And then weather effects, right? Weather effects. I take one damage. Yep. And get to experience weather. Uh, earnings. Go here. And I'll get two money. Um, then, uh, your cabin. I can't fill yep. mine. Night actions, sleep, restore. Where am I at? You're here. Okay, so I don't get any. Nope. Restore. Okay. And advance the calendar. Back up to the game. All right. I am going to connect it. I'm going to come up here for one grit. You got to roll. Oh, shit. Agility is nothing. I'm not going to do that. Okay. <laughs> one. All right. So then I'll just one, two, three. Okay. Then for four, I'll attack him. Okay. I don't know I'm doing that. Do that. And then the music plays. Yes, sir. One, two, three, four. Okay. I'm gonna go with a a Jericho Blitz. It's a it's a dancing dude and it blocks a gun. Okay, this is a running dude and it blocks a block. Damn, I was hoping you were trying to shoot me. Uh, so I have to make, make a strength a check. Strength. Yep. I have a four. That is Six. not gonna make it. Nope. So then you take one damage All right. from a tackle. Yeah. All right. Next round. Oh, I'm definitely pulling from the bottom. Fucking of my deck. cheater. Yep. Um. All right, I'm gonna on a block. This is you're also blocking, too. so yep. nothing happens. Nothing happens. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna block. I'm gonna shoot you in the face. So, but luckily, it doesn't block anything. It doesn't block my block. Six. One damage. Uh, one damage. Yep. And I block it. Nope. It, it it doesn't have a gun on there. Your thing doesn't cancel out my shield, does it? 
You're blocking a bullet, though. Now, that look, doesn't. That shit doesn't make sense. I'm not saying nothing. I agree with you. Okay. But okay, the cards don't okay. lie. <laughs> Where the fuck is my horse attack? <laughs> uh, all right, I'm gonna do a body slam. So this one stops shields. This and... one stops yours. Oh, that's bullshit. Yep, so Every that's fucking time I try to do it. To you. This is why I die. This is why I'm hot. This is why I'm hot. <laughs> I'm but you're fucking Superman, not. though, because you blocked a bullet. I did. <laughs> a lot of luck it did me. Um, oh, you know what I can try and do? Here, so I'm going to use this, but to move. And I'm going to move one. But if I block it, it means you can't <laughs> use it. Because I blocked the fist. Oh, that's bullshit. Yeah. Get in the comments. Get in the comments. Where's combat in this shit? Does it just block the card entirely? I think that's what we've been doing. Yeah. That's Displays what which other cards are canceled when the card is played. If the card icon of an opponent's card matches your own cancellation icon, then the opponent's card is canceled and has no effect during that engagement. Well, luckily you only block, so it's not like I'm yeah. hurt. Okay. Sweet. Let me get these out of the way. Um. I will... Try and tackle. So block. I'm gonna block yours. And uh, do one, one damage. damage. All right. Fun, fun, fun exercise. Fun fights. Cool. So then you drop your money. It uh, resources. You drop resources and heads. I think it's one mm -hmm. isn't it? No, sir. I looked it up. Let's see. Because I was worried that we did it wrong last time. Uh, if you faint for any reason other than a PvP fight, you immediately drop all resources and heads. And place them in your current acre. After experiencing loss, move okay. to jail if you faint and walk committed. Bro. Okay. So I go to to the dock. To dock. I spend another fucking grit to get out. I'm assuming also that's not a movement. Um. So then you're max bigger again. <sighs> yeah. I guess I'll. I can't go to the fucking statue because someone wasn't asking yep. <laughs> for some reason. I'll go to the bank. Was the the vagabond was the asshole? <laughs> And I'm going to withdraw. Jesus. One, two, three, four. Eating five there. That's my turn. Okay. One, two, three. You're skipping all over the place. Four. <laughs> oh, I guess. Event. Going from here to here. Yeah. Nope. Mark hasn't done one event. Nope. I did. I fucked Mark has on done that. one event. Yeah. <laughs> no, I mean like that you pulled. Five. Oh, that's right. You have plus one movement. Yup. I've unwittingly given Mark the victory somehow. I'll do a grit to go into here. You can't go in the bank. And I'm going to fight you. you. Can't fight me in the bank. I'm going to fight you in the bank. It's illegal. Okay. All right. So Mark's going to try and fight me. Oh, actually, that? can I ambush you? Is that a thing? So I wasn't going to remind you. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to ambush you. <laughs> Must be within line of sight. Oh, actually, no, you can't ambush me because I'm inside. So you would have to get a two or higher to, to fight inside the building. Huh? If I'm inside a building, yeah, you have to beat that check to be able to shoot into it. Just a regular ass check? Yeah, but I think it still triggers the combat. But it would still ambush, though. Because I'm shooting. Yeah, the range away. listed on the range weapon, exhaust it. Exhaust the range weapon to start the fight, and then. Okay. Yeah, you would do whatever. Okay. So you get to roll that. So do I roll. That was to see if you shot it. And then this is to roll for this. Yeah. Um. So yeah, it pops off. So right, one so damage. One damage. Me. All right. Mark is going after the brother. See how this works. <laughs> All right. So I know you don't have any more guns. All right, I'm going to uh, do these and then one, two, three, reveal. Okay. All right, one, two, three, reveal. Body slam. So you are the attacker. Yep. Uh, So yours first, but you don't do any damage. Yep. Mine, I need to make an agility. It's uh, a zero, strength. though. So you're not in range of me. Oh, yeah. Well, then. Okay. I'm going to use mine to move. Okay. 
and go here. Next round. All right, review. So you're first. Okay, I'm using it to move. All right, and I block, but since you're not doing anything, yep. I'm gonna move to here. You fucker. Yeah, come at me, Mark. I'm trying to start fights and shit. Uh oh. Okay. I'll 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 go with this one. Reveal. So you're first. Okay. Uh, mine blocks a shield. Yeah. This is an issue? Yeah, I know. Uh, mine blocks a run. But yours isn't a run, so I'm going to move one. And then I get to roll agility to see if I can it is another. A it's a wrong symbol. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, doesn't, so only one. Okay. Uh, I'm going to tackle. Okay. One damage. One damage. Okay. Perfect. One, two, three. Disciplined aggression. Immediately choose how the opponent uses their card. I'm going to say yours is movement. But you have to roll a seven. No, I just get it. No. Mm. I can't use my, uh, this shit. Nope. Okay. So All one right, damage to you. Oh, no. My body. All right. I'll have to go back and reread the shit, but I don't think this is right. All right, one, two, three, bam. So I'm going to do a blitz. Okay, I'm going to hit you. All right. One damage. One damage. And then the blitz, seven or higher. Wow. All I need is a three, too, which is really shitty. Draw a card. All right. One, two, three. Block. Uh, nope. So no matter what. Uh, oh, did you block a block? I did block a block. Oh, well. So then one damage to you. Mark has done one damage to me, knocking me out. Yes, sir. And uh, unlawfully, I might add. I get. You get to loot the other player. A check mark. Check mark. And so, I get to loot you. Looting. When you defeat another player during PvP, the defeated player does not drop their resources and heads before moving to Doc Barber the jail. Instead, the winner may choose one of the following. <laughs> Take up to as many of their resources and gems as you can fit. Take up to $10 of the cash. Take a single item or head that does not display the looting, the no loot symbol. Look through their combat deck and take one card that does not display the no loot symbol. Take one rider token. Must make a persuasion check. Take a mount. Must make a persuasion check. Send them to jail and receive their bail money or one notoriety point if they can't pay their bail. And those are your, your options. I can send you to jail. Yeah, you can send me to jail. <laughs> and then when I pay to get out, you receive I it. I get the bail money? Mm -hmm. Okay. What happens if I just take your money? Then you just get it. Okay. And I go to Doc Barber. I'm going to do that. Okay. So you get to take up to 10, which is my five, I think I had here. Yeah. Okay. You piece of shit. And I go here. Um, And then I still have turns left. I'm going to do... Mark's a little piece of shit. Yup. I'm going to run back to my cabin, uh -huh. evading the law. I'll be like, everyone saw that, right? That man just beat the shit out of me. One, two. A black man, no less. Three, four, five. This fucking horse and speed. Um, while I'm here, fuck it. Why not? You have another grit? Yeah. I didn't get anything, and then I'm going to pop in my cabin. And then from there, I'm going to use this Ooh. to get it. It's at four now, right? Because it's not. Yes. Yeah. And then I assume the fire spreads and you burn down the cabin? Yep. All right. Mark wins. The cheater. Bow, 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 bow. The insane vagabond. Which I only wins. needed one, so that was close. What was your off. one? Uh, I needed to get one head. Oh, That's why I kept trying to fight shit and it gotcha. never worked out. Gotcha. And so I was like, oh, I'll buy a gun. But like, I didn't have enough money at the time to buy like an actual weapon. Yeah. And then I figured I could get this and then try and loot one of these chests. Because I don't know what they actually give you. Like this one gives you just $3. Okay, never mind. This one gives you... An anvil? An item. Oh, okay. See, that's what I... Like, I figured one yeah. of them would be something good, and then I could fight one of these people. Yeah. But I didn't have agility to make it through there, so I was like, that's not happening. And then, like, you couldn't get through there either, mm -hmm. right? So, yeah. and then when you fought me, I was like, if I get really lucky and beat Mark, then I could take his head. You take my head, And then yeah. I can win the game, because I just need to... Uh... What? How would you have ruled that? Because it says, end your turn. 
So would I have had to wait and then? I end think my at turn? night, because it's a nighttime action. Yeah. So it would have to be. See, I need more clarification on this part because yeah. some of these say end your turn, and then the rest of yeah. them are nighttime things. I would I would rule it as like since it's on the nighttime, like once it goes to the night phase, you would get it okay. if you had it. Like because if you got it after you already ended your turn, that seems kind of shitty. Yeah, kind of like the count it. the sleep jaw. Yeah, where it's like if you kill an enemy, how are you going to yeah. sleep? It? Yeah, so, yeah. So yeah. Okay. Well, we could pop over to the final thoughts. Let's do it. Finally, thoughts. thoughts. So, Mark, you won. How do you feel about it? Um, yeah, if you watched the previous video, I kind of ranked it a 2 or a 4.5, like, with the full rule set. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to stick by that. It's a 4.5. It yep. was a lot of fun with, like, all of the rules in place. Mm -hmm. um, and it felt like the... It, I really like the mechanic of having the, like, day and night objectives. Yeah. Because, like, we played the game completely different yeah like it was like night and day the way that we played the game Literally. and it was based on like who our character was mm -hmm. like i was a what was it like an insane a vagabond yeah. or something like that and you were a wise collector so like you were the like, getting money doing like <laughs> the rational shit. things yeah. and i was a loose cannon like burning shit down and like just living out in the wilderness taking damage just to get a point like it was it was just a lot of whatever. writing a lot of fun yeah, yeah. All right. I think four 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 point five for me yeah. for sure. I'm also gonna give it a four point five. Um, so I really enjoyed this over the one that we played before. And I told Mark when we started, I can see now why the intro version had so little in there because there is a lot to like ramp up to like the full game. That being said, I still would have preferred to have essentially the full game in it because, as we pointed out, the intro version just doesn't feel as fun. And you hear and read about all these things that you get to do, but then you don't get to do it. Yeah. So this one, even though there was much more to it, was a lot more fun. And I think it'd be a lot more fun if we had four or five players. Yeah, I agree. Because um, there is a two-player version of this that I... It's basically the same thing, except there's only one of these. So that way we have to interact with each other. Okay. I liked how much we interacted. I didn't have yep. a problem with that. Um, yeah, because we only like fought once, right? Yeah. It was the ones at the end. And then, like, I liked that you had to travel over here to set fire to my cabin yep. instead of just being able to move next door and set fire to me. Um, but that being said, I do think this game would be much more fulfilling with higher player count. And I think that there's, like, one other version. So, like, there's the, the gameplay one is what we did. Gameplay two is this. Gameplay three is another version. Gameplay four is the two player. And then gameplay five is the solo player. So I think gameplay three might have like respawning NPCs, more okay. things going on like that. Um, outside of that, the only other thing that I would want is just like a little bit more clarification with the rules. Um, there are certain times where we had to like question things and then just kind of go with it. But like it would have been better if it clarified in the rule book. So like uh, when the night events happen, because some of them say when you end your turn, some of them say when you sleep, which there is a like a an actual breakdown of when things happen and sleeping is number five but then night actions is number four and night actions is when enemies attack you so it's like when when would this happen you know um also so you were illegally looting and or burning down my cabin which is it's only if i lose all vigor though yeah i know but it's crazy that you you fighting me doesn't count as a legal action that's, that's true yeah you fighting and stealing from me is fine <laughs> me either sending you to jail or yeah. sending you to the doctor isn't it's like cool <laughs> just throwing you in there it's anyway fucking, it's um, the wild west man but yeah so the game's really fun i do like the amount of variety that there is in there yeah I, at first i was a little let down that some of our things did overlap like the i think we both had the the hidden path yeah the hidden path and the one uh one dollar one head one resource yeah but also, it's not like those are easy to get, so I'm okay with it. Yeah, and like everything else was different too, yeah. like completely different. Like yours was like sleep in the vault. One of mine was sleep in a cabin cave. Per <laughs> you sleep in a cave? <laughs> so I was like, I could I could sleep, like on the other part um, yeah, I did. Yeah, I was like, one. I could do a cave, I guess, yeah. but then there's only that one cave. So I was like, I don't want to risk it. But anyway, um, real fun. Yeah. Uh, a lot of different options you could choose from. We didn't even see any, like really any of the events. So no. that's even a more element of confusion and stuff. Because there's like, since this is the full one, there's still like a whole bunch of cards that we, or like oh, things like that we haven't, we haven't used. used yet. Okay. Um, not because they're, they come through events. Probably there's this cabin. Oh shit. Hunter's expedition thing. Then there's also this graveyard that I don't know where it comes from. Wow. So 
there's more shit in here. And like the, this cabin, you actually build up because there's other tiles that you put on there. Where That's are they? Super fucking cool. Yeah. So like, yeah, I feel like the replayability of this game is very high. super high. And I do like how when we were talking about it and like what we imagined this game would be, there are ways that you could, in theory, go about it without being violent. Mm-hmm. And like, like, because I know culture doesn't like PvP all that much. Yeah. So I think there is a world as long as there's one of those things where like you don't have to get ahead. I think there is a world that exists where you can just get like collecting things yeah. and scouting and building cabins and stuff like that. Because in contrast to our base game, we didn't even do our endeavors. Like I leveled mine up just because, yeah. but you didn't. But do like it at we all. didn't. Yeah, like based on our win conditions, like we didn't need them at all. Yeah. yeah. So four point five, four point five, four point five. That gets a little stamp. Boom. Stamp of. So I, I could say at the very least. Because I was wondering how we would do it if the two-player version gets a higher rating than, like, the four-player version. Mm -hmm. So we'll give it, like, a stamp or, like, our seal of approval for, like, two players. For two players, yeah. Yeah. So for two players, it's a very fun game. Um, This might, our four-player one, as we said in that video, might change based off of everyone knowing the rules and playing the full game. Because I think everyone would love it if it was this. I think so, too. Yeah. Yeah. Especially since, like, we wouldn't have to add anything else to it. We would just have people. So, like... There's no like extra shit over here or extra thing we have to add. Yeah. So real fun game. Yeah. Uh, I don't think it's actually available right now for people to purchase, but if you can find it, I recommend you get it. Yeah. And don't play the tutorial. Don't play it. Don't, don't play or if you do the play the tutorial, play the B side. Um, yeah, I guess that there's be. technically a little bit more that you're going to have to learn, but I think everyone would have a better time Yeah. because if Agreed. you do the A side, it's going to be a logging simulator Yeah. and two people will like it. One person, two people will not. Yeah, <laughs> because it's not the game. <laughs> yes, it's not. It's just like <laughs> you're you're an outlaw. You're not a and logger. And in theory, it's like it's not like it's called logging simulator. Yeah, but like yeah. you have to build a cabin. You have to master an endeavor. You have to buy something. And it's yep. like everything you can do by logging. So yep. just log, get your cabin out, and then go into yep. town. And then you're done. Sell it. You're done. So thank you all for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Check down below for ways that you can support us on YouTube memberships or Patreon. And come back next time for a game that I'm hopeful I will win, <laughs> but probably will not. Bye. Bye. Do, 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 do. I lost. <laughs> I lost.